temperatures climbing into the upper 80s and maybe getting close to 90, closer to 90 anyway, over our far western counties. But notice off to our east, maybe in the upper 70s to low 80s today. That's where we're already seeing some showers off into east Texas, and we'll see a few more spreading westward. Now that moisture has increased as well as Francine makes its way toward the Louisiana coast. Those dew points in the upper 60s to low 70s this morning. We had those 40s and low 50s the past couple of days and still looking at that over our far northwestern counties. But yeah, it is more muggy. So that muggy meter, we've gone from pleasant to uh, very sticky out there in some locations here uh, over the uh, past couple of days. It's been very nice, but you'll notice that humidity that has increased across the area too. Now we've talked about uh, Francine now a hurricane with those 90 mile per hour winds and will strengthen a little bit more before it makes landfall later today. But notice on the northern periphery of that we are seeing those uh, showers already push into East Texas and those will continue to drift west westward over the next uh, few hours. So as we head toward midday, getting into the early afternoon, we'll have at least some showers out there to talk about maybe an isolated thunderstorm. So we are looking at potentially those tropical downpours from Francine. But again, the farther west we go, those storms will become a little more isolated for us. So here's our time cast taking us toward midday into the afternoon hours. We'll have those isolated showers, maybe a thunderstorm or two for that drive home. Those will continue maybe into the early evening. Still could see some after midnight tonight heading into tomorrow morning. I think just about all of that will be gone across uh, North Texas. So that will be our rain chance here this week. And then we'll turn our attempt our attention to those uh, temperatures that will be heating up. So we'll keep it in the upper 80s today and tomorrow. But by Friday, we're looking at mid 90s, then those upper 90s over the weekend. So yes, that heat is going to be back across North Texas and those 90s do stick around in that 14 day forecast as well. Some low end rain chances again early next week, but we'll see those daytime highs staying in the low 90s as we go through all of next week. All right, back over to station now. Checking on traffic. Thanks, Greg.